or cleveland.com. Hey, Torian. Um, why have you been able to fit in so well so early with this team, do you think? Uh, I mean, I mean, credit to them. They embraced me from day one. And uh, I think it just shows uh, what type of player I am and how uh, easy it is for me to adapt to, honestly, any situation, just whatever I'm asked to do. And they, I feel like I have the capabilities and ability to, to do it. I mean, you were a starter early in your career uh, with Atlanta. You started early on in Brooklyn, and then all of a sudden, you were out of the rotation early on this season with the Nets. Um, I don't know if you feel like you have to send a reminder of what you're capable of, but but are you do you do you feel like you're doing that? I'm 100. Um, percent If you think about it, I've been um, kind of learning and um, behind some very good players throughout my career. Um, and also has five different coaches in five seasons. So it's all about just trying to find a home, continuing to take advantage of the opportunities given to you and um, control what you can control. Those other things um, happen that you, you can't really control. So it's, it's all about being a professional and just continue to get better. Angel. Andrew Green, Fox Sports, Ohio. Torian, when you're looking at just chemistry, what you guys were able to do off the bench and what you guys have been able to do in the last few games, uh, how would you describe it? I know that Jared Allen being with you and you having the you know, time in with him in Brooklyn, but the, the, the squad that coach puts out there for that second unit, how do you describe your chemistry? Um, I wouldn't say flawless, but it's getting to the point where we're just playing now. It's less thinking. Um, it's more flow. And uh, I think the fact that we play super hard um, and we play together and we play, and we, we, we lock down and, and we play defense, I think that's what gets our offense going. And once we have both rolling, I think we're pretty hard to guard and then everybody's in it. Um, we always get good, good vibes from the bench, which is um, great. And it goes in, it goes, it has a lot to do with team wins. And just as far as the balance, I know that earlier today I asked, um, you know, who was the best guard as far as laws, but it seemed like you were able to connect with Andre jumping underneath a few times. What have you seen in his game and how have you guys been able to manufacture more points, even if it doesn't come from the defensive end? What are your thoughts on just how you guys have been able to adjust on the offensive end? Uh, well, Andre, he knows he's um, our, our, our monster inside. He was going to bring the presence and uh, put a lot of pressure on the rim. So, um, just driving and, and just making the right play, really. There's no, there's not much science to it. Just whenever you see him open, just give it to him. He's a, he's a force down there, so um, you got to respect that. Kelsey. Kelsey Russo, The Athletic. Torian, building off of Chris's first question, I mean, when you, did you expect, you know, how fast you were able to get acclimated? Like, when you got here, like, I guess, learning the systems early and everything, but, like, did you just have this anticipation of, like, okay, I can fit in early, and then, you know, you've been able to show it? Uh, well, yeah, I, I mean, I had the mindset of just telling myself that I was going to fit in. Um, there's not many places I've been or um, teams that I've been on or uh, players that I've played with that I haven't fit in. Um, I think it's just more about just taking advantage of um, the opportunities given and just showing what I can do and um, trying to be the glue guy. Uh, we have a, a lot of young guys that are... Um, Willing to learn, they listen. Um, such as myself. I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm not too old, but I've been in the league for five years, seen a lot of basketball, played a lot of basketball, and um, the terminology changes. But at the end of the day, um, everything is all the same, honestly. So that's more so. The transition is just the uh, terminology, but I'm coming along well with that as well. Too. Thank you.